All right, hey everybody, welcome back to Off Center Television. I'm Roz Allen, and today I'm hanging out at the Bang On store on Robson Street with none other than Canadian R&B sensation Woo. Keisha Shante. <laughs> How's it going, Keisha? I'm very good. How are you? <laughs> I'm good. I heard sensation made me feel excited. Oh, I think you've heard that a lot lately, right? Oh, thank you. Um, mm -hmm. it, it still sounds good oh, when you say good. it. <laughs> well, I've been reading up on you, and I found some information online. I cannot believe the accolades that you're getting, my dear. Thank you. It's amazing. Thank you. I mean, what is it? It's sexy. I can't. I had to write them all down. I couldn't keep up. It was sexiest female, best album. Uh, you had a gold album last yeah. year. Yeah. Best new artist from the Canadian Urban Music Awards. Um. Yeah. You know in 2005? That's a good, yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's exciting. It's, it's definitely a blessing. It just shows you a lot of hard work will pay off. So um, tell me about the new album. Tell me about the new album to you. Are yes. you excited about the new album? Yes, I am. The new album to you. I'm so excited about it. Um, it's fantastic. I, I'm really excited about it. I worked really, really hard on it. Everybody worked really, really hard on it. I worked with people, um, I, I went to the States to make the album, so I worked with a lot of greats, people that work with Michael Jackson and Beyonce and Tupac and um, Christina Aguilera and just just people, like amazing, fantastic people, producers from the writers, from the mixers, from the vocal arrangers, just a really great team. So I'm very excited about the new album. Vocally, you're going to hear growth. It's very personal, vulnerable, but it's still fun and it's relatable to people who are my age. It's acceptable by people who are older and little girls can listen to it at the same time. So I'm excited about it. And you're only 18. Yes, ma'am. Oh, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. How are you handling all the success? Um, I, I think I handle it pretty well. Um, it, it, it's exciting for me. I'm, I'm just really excited about it. Right. Yeah. yeah. And how, lo how, long, how long has it been since you knew that this was what you wanted to do? Um, I've probably known for about 12 years now. I started singing really, really young. My parents used to play every single genre of music you could possibly imagine in my household. So nice. it's cool. Nice. Yeah. You think that influenced you, hearing all the oh, different genres? Oh, definitely. And Especially like living in Canada. I'm so proud to live in Canada because it's so multicultural. And there's so many things you get to learn. And um, I think that reflects on me. And I think um, I'm going to probably intertwine that a lot more in my music in a couple more years and just developing that and doing that kind of stuff. Yeah. Right. It's kind of like, well, Nelly Furtado in a way, right? Like yeah. Nelly Furtado is, I think her, her background is Portuguese. Yes, I am too. too. Yeah. You're Portuguese as well? Yeah, I'm Portuguese, oh, um, Puerto Rican and Trinidadian. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I'm a big mix of oh, stuff. I know that you've performed with Destiny's Child. Yes. Is that right? And yes. so tell me a little bit about that. Um, well, Destiny's Child is on my label um, in Sony in the U.S. Right. So it was cool. It was fantastic opening up for them. It was awesome because it was our last show together um, on their tour. But not only that, um, it was in Canada. And it, it was in Vancouver, so it was fantastic. And getting to see them, they knew all the songs, and it was, it was really, really fun. I really enjoyed it. And um, Alicia Keys, and performed with Alicia Keys. A lot of different artists, it's fun. Where does all this drive come from? Um, just the way I was raised. I was raised an only child, and my mom's a strong, independent woman, so she's taught me how to be strong and <laughs> go strong for what I want. Yes. yes, go for what I want, but also being spiritual. Um, I'm just a very spiritual person, and I'm really close to God, and. Yeah, he keeps me focused. Things like that. And my friends, my family, my team, and yeah. And we're making a t-shirt today, I might add. Yes, we are. So why don't we go do that right now? Are okay. You ready? <laughs> okay, let's go. I'm excited. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my goodness. Those are adorable. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> that is so cute. So it's a dress. Is there like one particular phrase that you that you would like on your dress? Um, oh, that's like, nope. oh, I don't have words, but I have like a novel to live by. <laughs> Me well, too. It won't fit on one. It won't fit on one dress. No, it won't. <laughs> Are you serious? No, I know. Because I get into the six X's, so that would totally fit. And you. you're so petite. Look at this girl. She's in a size six children's size. Look at this. I love it. <laughs> Here it is. I just abandoned my dress. <laughs> Bang On has a new customer, Keisha Shante. Oh, look at that. That is so cute. So hot. Oh. Oh, my I God. love it. Oh, thank you. Oh, You're welcome. Do you want to beg? Hey, thank you. And thank you so much, Keisha. It was most thank wonderful you. to meet you. Thank you are you so too. lovely. Thank and you. much you continued too. success to <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. All thank right, you my dear. Sure. Hey, guys, this is Keisha Shante, and right now you're checking out Off Center Television. <laughs>